What up, YouTube? T Movies here. Blumhouse has shot this trailer for the upcoming horror film titled You Should Have Left, which is directed by uh, Stairs of Echoes director David Keogh and is based on a book by uh, Dan O'Cleaman. Anyway, uh, the film stars Kevin Bacon and Amanda Seyfried. Uh, here's what it's about Bacon and Seyfried stars as a couple seeking a uh, restful uh, vacation on an oscillated. Uh, edge of the world in the Welsh countryside only to uh, discover that secrets demand a reckoning and travel with them. Their marriage is shredding at the seams, uh, frayed by their uh, secretive uh, uh, his jealousy and uh, the shadow of his past. At first their vacation with their uh, six-year-old daughter uh, seems like a, per a perfect uh, retreat, but this distorted, uh, distorts into a perfect nightmare. When Theo's, uh, played by uh, Bacon, uh, gra grass on the reality, uh, begins to unravel, um, and he suspects that a sinister force within the house knows more than, than he or Susanna, played by Seyfried, have revealed, even to uh, each other. Alright, this actually sounds like it has a pretty interesting premise, and it is directed by David Keogh, who also was a uh, writer on uh, Jurassic Park. Uh, he also directed that uh, Joseph Girl 11 movie a couple years back, Premium Rush, which was pretty decent. So, I mean, not, not bad of uh, the trailer. To be honest, I'm a horror guy. If, if you guys follow me, you know I'm a big horror nut. Like, I do love the horror genre, but uh, this just didn't do so much. I mean, I do like Kevin Bacon. Of course, he's He's been acting for years, when you talk about, you know, Footloose, uh, he was also on that show The Falling, which was pretty decent. You know, I, I, of course, he is no stranger to the horror genre, because his first major feature was, of course, uh, Friday the 13th, the original, back in 1980, that lots of people did not even know that. Of course, he was in that not-so-good horror movie by Blumhouse a couple years ago, uh, In Darkness, or The Darkness, whatever that terrible horror film was for. Of course, it's, uh, you know, this film looks like it's going to have lots of jump scares, which could be a good thing and a bad thing once in a while. It depends. Uh, I do like Amanda Seyfried. I've been a fan of her ever since I saw her in Mean Girls. And since then, she's she did all way talk about Tattoo. She was just in Scoop. You know, of course, Mama Mia. I really adore Amanda Seyfried. And her and Kevin Bacon as a couple could be, I don't know, intriguing. I mean, the age difference seems a little awkward, but hey, Kevin Bacon and uh, Amanda Seyfried, those two are still awesome, so that that's cool there. Um, but I don't know, the trailer just didn't really do much for me. I mean, it didn't look that scary. It looked, you know, this literally looks like a horror film that I've seen, you know, thousands of times. But I don't know, I'll still probably check it out. Uh, anyway, uh, you should... The film is set you hit theaters, um, not hit theaters, the film is set you hit VOD on June 19th, which is, of course, my birthday, so, at least I got a film to check out on my birthday. Anyway, uh, the, you know, you should have a left, the, uh, it's set you premiere on a, oh, wait, where is that? Um, let me leave you guys, what did you throw of the trailer for, uh, you should have a left, the? did you like it, did you not like it, are you a fan of Kevin Bacon? And as well, are you a fan of Amanda Safer as well? Drop a comment below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for more notifications. This is Simu Sangha.